Welcome to the playground. My name is Valerie Agenor and I'm the Community Center Manager here at Oak Grove Park. More specifically, the Father Gerard Jean-Gis Community Center. Father Gerard Jean-Gis was a pillar in the Haitian community. He even ran the Haitian Refugee Center here in Miami-Dade from 1977 to 1990. He is an internationally known political figure, a fighter of Haitian rights, and a crusader for Haitian refugees. Built in 2019, the Father Gerard Jean Gis Community Center was an ideal birth by Miami-Dade County Parks, Recreation, and Open Spaces, as well as our District 2 Commissioner, Jean Monestine. Commissioner Jean Monestine is an impactful leader. He shows his care the way that Father Gerard Jean Gis did. We know that this center will do the work that he anticipated it to do to be a place for the people. Welcome to the playground at Oak Grove Park. I'm Commissioner Jean Monestime representing District 2, and it's a pleasure to invite you here to this park. The Father Gérard Jean Juste Community Center is one of the largest state-of-the-art community centers in the county. I sponsored the resolution in 2014 uh, to name the center after Father Jean Juste. Uh, Father Jean Juste was the first Haitian-American ordained Catholic priest in the United States of America. It's quite a pleasure to stand here on this ground knowing that I, I, I represent uh, uh, the legacy of a great uh, American uh, uh, human being, uh, Father Gérard Jean Juste. Some of us knew of him, some of us uh, never met him, but uh, his work continues to many others in this community and, and out of this community as well. I met Father Jean Juste as a 17-year-old in this community in 1981, I knew that was uh, someone that young people like myself needed to watch, uh, needed to uh, emulate if we could. Um, uh, and he remains uh, today a, 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 a figure, a very unmatched figure uh, as a leader in our community. Uh, we can have uh, other great leaders uh, uh, emanating from this community, but we will never have another Father Jean Jus. We've only been here for two years. This will be our third year standing. The turkey giveaway has been able to feed well over a thousand families within our community. The bike giveaway, he's had Christmas dinners. He's done a lot. In the short time that this building has stood, it has had a major impact within this community. And not even just in the Miami-Dade area, also within Broward. People come down here just to see this area and to partake in the activities here. What do we offer? We offer so much. There is a game room, there is a fitness room, a fully stocked fitness room. We have our soccer fields that will be soon turned into an NCAA sized turf field. We have our pool that is open and children are allowed to come in and learn to swim no matter where you live. Our AOA programs which helps active older adults We've provided a space for them to be able to socialize, for them to continue to have fitness, for them to continue to be amongst others and not secluded. Actually, my journey here with Miami-Dade County started at this very building. So this building and I have been able to grow together. I have learned so much about not only Miami-Dade County, but also about myself, about the leader that I want to become because of this building, because of our great commissioner, and because of the leadership that I've been given here.